Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And we're back. This is Hill. And we're doing the Leviathan DLC. And I think this may be the final part. So, after we concluded the last episode, after fighting off hordes and hordes of Reapers and then getting this Triton mech, I did go back and collect all of the um, data pads. We got the experience, some meta gel. There were a few other logs, but uh, nothing that consequential. Um, we're going to go ahead now and proceed into the mech. All right, Cortez. You ready for a swim? I'm ready. Let's go. Take care down there, Commander. Closing hatch. Engaging systems. Ready. Testing comm link. I read you. Here goes. Looks good so far. Copy that. Cortez? Cortez! Oh boy. Am I in control? Not yet. go the lights. Not sure if you can read me out there. Looks like I finished the major descent. Can't see much from here. Suit is holding up. Emergency systems have come online. Life support operational. All right. I think these flares are auto firing. Wow. Um. Scanner indicates the probe is below my position. Looking for a way down. Can I jump? I don't seem to be able to. Oh, no, here we go. We're going down. Shutting down all non-critical systems to preserve remaining power. Not sure how much juice the emergency thruster will need to get me back to the surface. Can't worry about that now. Getting some strange readings from the probe. Something is definitely down there. Can it jump? There we're going. Oh, oh. Gently. Woo. That was not gentle. Reading the probe directly below me. Looks like the final drop. Oh my goodness, really? <laughs> I guess we have no choice. All right, Shepard, I, I hope you live through this. Can't see anything just yet.
found the probe. Seems intact. I'm gonna keep moving. Yeah, here's the probe. If there were any doubt. Yeah, I do not know. As we are playing blind, never played Leviathan before. Did not know what direction to go. Oh, it auto fired a flare. That might be a clue. Let me go to the top of this room. Whoa, what is that? Whoa. I think something might be coming up. Oh, it is. Look. What's happening? Your memories give voice to our words. Your nature will be revealed to us. Accept this. Hmm. All right. Yeah. We're wasting time. Took down the Reaper. You could help us win this war. Why the hell are you hiding down here? There is no war. There is only the harvest. Then help us stop it. None have possessed the strength in past cycles. Your own species could be destroyed with a single thought. But you are different. I have witnessed your actions in this cycle. The destruction of Sovereign. The fall of the Collectors. The Reapers perceive you as a threat. And I must understand why. Harbinger was the first Reaper by destroying these Leviathan creatures. Let's ask about the first harvest. How did the intelligence defeat you? To find a solution, it required information. Physical data drawn from organic life in the cosmos. It created an army of pawns that searched the galaxy, gathering this data. There was no warning. No reason given when they turned against us. Only slaughter. Only the harvest. 
Let's ask about intelligence. You built that machine despite what you saw the other races experience. Why? You cannot conceive of a galaxy that bends to your will. Every creature, every nation, every planet we discovered became our tools. We were above the concerns of lesser species. The intelligence was envisioned as simply another tool. And now we all pay the price for your mistake. There was no mistake. It still serves its purpose. Let's ask about your survival. How did you remain hidden all this time? Our extermination was not complete. Some survived and found refuge in the dark corners of the galaxy. I am their progeny. Over the cycles, the thrall races were controlled, removing traces of our existence as we directed them to. In this way, our survival was kept secret from the Reapers. Today, we reach out through the fragments and watch for discovery. Fragments? You mean the artifacts we found? They provide a window into the galaxy. Tools for exploring the events of this cycle for the safety of this world. Through them, we watch, we study, and remain in the shadows. Let's talk about the Crucible. What do you know about the Crucible? We have watched its construction before. It has never been completed. Those who have tried still fell victim to the harvest. Its outcome is unknown. Let's talk about the Reapers. Tell me about the Reapers. Each harvest ends with the birth of a Reaper. Perfect in its design. Each formed in Harbinger's image. Our image. Each Reaper has the power to influence organics. Over countless cycles, this ability was refined, perfected, and gave rise to indoctrination. Why cycles? What's the point of all these harvests? The intelligence has one purpose. Preservation of life. That purpose is not being fulfilled. It directed the Reapers to create the mass relays to speed the time between cycles to greatest efficiency. The galaxy itself became an experiment. Evolution its tool. Will it ever end? Unknown. Until the intelligence finds what it's looking for, the harvest will continue. Okay, you made your point. Will you help stop the cycle? I have searched your mind. You are an anomaly, yet that is not enough. Wait! The cycle will continue. No. You've been watching. You know this cycle is different. We will survive. You will remain here as a servant of our needs. The Reapers will harvest the rest. If you release me, no one has to be harvested. It already has. The Reapers know where you are. You can't just watch anymore. You have to fight. Even if you survive the battle today, the Reapers won't stop. Ever. Release me and we have a chance to end this once and for all. You should be. It is clear why the Reapers perceive you as a threat. Your victories are more than a product of chance. We will fight, but not for you or any lesser race. We were the first, the Apex race. We will survive. And the Reapers who trespass on this world will understand our power. They will become our slaves.
instantly. Shepard, can you hear me? He's freezing! <coughs> you okay? <coughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Hell of a headache. We're lucky we got you back. I've got Ann Bryson on the comm. Good. Put her through. Commander. You feeling better? Yes, thank you. I'm doing fine. What happened? We found it, Ann. We found Leviathan. Was it worth it? Yes. It was. We exposed it. Pushed it into the light. Whether it likes it or not, it's a part of this war now. Sounds like an amazing story. One for the history books. Well, I look forward to hearing all about it. My father would appreciate this, knowing the truth is out there. In the meantime, Admiral Hackett has asked me to join his scientific team. We all have our part to play. I should get to it. Take care, Anne. And thanks for all your help. Shepard up. Commander, I finished reading your report. The Alliance wanted more intelligence on the Reapers. I'd say we got it. Our people will be studying it for years to come. They're already calling it the Leviathan Codex. It rewrites galactic history as we know it. Whatever else it means, it tells me the Reapers had a beginning. And maybe now we'll provide them with an end. That's one way to look at it. I guess it's the only way. So go out there and make it happen. This is a big step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. Thank you, sir. Hack it out. All right, dominate. Unlocked. Wow. So that's what they were using. Okay, we've got a lot of uh, updates here. All right, let's, um, I think I kept getting, nope, there's no Admiral Hackett. Nothing, nobody wants to talk to me. All right. Let's check our military strength. It is increasing. And I'm just wondering, I mean, if we didn't have these DLCs, would I even make it? To the, uh, I think it's like 3,100, I think is the recommended uh, military strength that's needed. All right, so we have Dr. Ann Bryson now joining our team. We have the Alliance Third Fleet. We have the Leviathan Enthrallment Team. We have Normandy-class frigates. Okay, people, did you know there was more than one frigate like this? I thought this was like a unique ship of Turian and human design. Okay, well, it's good to know that there are more. Good to know. All right, and we have a Hammerhead Squadron and an Atlas Mech Detachment. And we have intelligence on the Reapers, knowing that they came from the Leviathans. All right, well, that was the, the Leviathan DLC, and I have to say, I really enjoyed it, as you can probably tell from the excitement that I have in my voice. It was really good, really, really, it was good. And we're gonna end the episode here and we will return. There's still more to do. We will return with more Mass Effect. This is Hill and I'm out.